What's going on, everybody? It is your boy, Swan539. I am back again. I just got 2K22, so I'm actually letting that install right now. I bought, uh, bought it used. I also bought something else used. Um, I have bought for some streaming. I have bought the PS5 HD camera. Um, I figured I'd buy it pre-owned because it saves me some money. Um, I can return it if I don't think it's good. Um, and it it's a camera um it's not like it's a console or anything so what's the worst that could happen um and i figured too you know i bought games and all that pre-owned from gamestop before and games have always been good but i figured let me buy like an accessory this time and so we're gonna get into the unboxing of this first thing i like though i like the clear packaging because i like that i can see everything um and when i saw this i'm not gonna lie from what the picture looks like online this camera is supposed to be really huge. This camera is super, super small. I mean, it's smaller than the original. So let's get right into this. I also like that, what is it? I think they just got, sorry about that. It's just a nice, you know, like, it's a good, like kind of, it's got like a resealable, like Ziploc kind of package. I like that. You don't need to do nothing special. Um, they've got like some plastic and all that on here. This is the mount for it. Mount works really easily. Um, overall, it's it's a little kind of, you can't really see in the light and all that. It's a, like, it's not like, it's just like dusty on the stand. Um, nothing necessarily wrong with it, just, just dust. That would happen from anybody's house. The stand is hard plastic. Um, at the end, it's kind of like soft touch rubber but most of it is honestly hard plastic so let me just get the plastic piece off and we're gonna plug this in right now and I will show you guys what it looks like also just so you know before I plug it in though um, in terms of packaging again little rubber band on it it is USB A so you can plug it into the USB port on the back of your PS5 um, it's pretty decently long cable, so let's get right into it, and I will plug this in and show you guys how it looks. Hey everybody, bonus clip, one more before I go. So if you look at it when I'm recording on my phone, the colors on my phone actually look a lot better, and they're actually a lot more yellow. Um, like this wall is probably gonna look really yellow. It's actually a white wall, the white balance is kind of off. So right now, the camera and the colors actually look really good. So right now, you know, the lighting situations are changing um i would record in a dark room this is a light that i have it does white light blue light and yellow light so like if i was to adjust this light you can see how if i turn it off and i turn it on you know this lighting changes a lot of stuff and then it actually doesn't look that bad like even the clarity and all that even while i'm looking at it on my screen it actually looks less like less dull and less flat so i actually want to show you guys so right now on the camera that looks really like it i look really like yellowish orange but in real life looking at the camera i actually look um very normal you know we can brighten it up like this i can change the color that's a blue light and that's a white light so you know, we can see actually the white light looks really good on the camera. The white light and the yellow light like this with less brightness. Um, on the phone, it doesn't look good, but in real life, it actually looks really good. And I think the clarity is fine. So, you know, again, it's not the most high-end camera, but I actually think it looks really, really good. I'm going to change the angle, though, because I don't like how I keep looking at it like that. My eyes look crossed, like I look like cross-eyed. But I think I really like it. Um... Again, is it a high-end camera? No, but a, this is like a cheap light on Amazon, like 10, 15 bucks. You know, you could change like, and it's yellow, it's yellowish light, um, blue light, and then a white light. But a cheap light like this, and then you just kind of go around and play in the settings with the brightness and the contrast. You can get this to a pretty good looking stream. Like right, I know right now my face looks really yellow orangey, but in real life, it actually looks really good, like the color. Like I look like normal brown, like I usually do. So I really like it. Um, you know, I think 
I've seen some people like with their cameras, they have really bad quality. Like this one has really good, pretty decent quality. Like that's 1080 quality. That's not, it's not 720, that's regular 1080p full HD quality. It's not 4K, but it's good. So I, I recommend the PS5 camera. I'm gonna be streaming with it. If you guys have one that's like super blurry or like really bad quality and it doesn't look like, you know, like this. I know the phone's not really doing it justice right now, but if you have one and it's like really bad, I'd honestly, I'd return it because this camera right now is used and it's really good. I mean, this is like literally better than like some of the Logitech webcams that I have. And honestly, I think it even looks better with the white light. So let me know what you guys think. Um, I think the PS5 camera is really good though. So thank you guys all for watching. You'll see me streaming with it soon. And um, again, follow me on Twitch to see me streaming with it. But appreciate y'all for watching.